Coming up on the News Channel, the debut of CNN number two. And we'll have a live report from Times Square, so stay with us. It's now 14 minutes away from the new year, at least on the East Coast. And at this point, we'd like to welcome our viewers of the Superstation, WTBS, and the first viewers watching on Cable News Network 2. This is a special evening for those of us here at CNN and WTBS. We are not only ushering in a new year, we're also inaugurating a revolutionary new service for cable viewers, CNN 2. During the next few minutes, we'll be telling you more about CNN 2, and at midnight, We'll bring you the first broadcast from Turner Broadcasting's newest news facility. But first, let's go live to Times Square in New York, where James Allen Miklaszewski is standing by with a live report on the countdown to 1982. Mick? Thank you, Lou. Welcome to N2. From New York's Times Square, James Allen Miklaszewski. Back to Lou and Kathleen in Atlanta. Thanks, Mick, and we'll be checking back with him in just a few minutes. But right now, we'd like to tell you something about Turner Broadcasting's newest service, Cable News Network 2. In just a few minutes, CNN 2 will premiere from its brand new studio facility here in Atlanta, and Cable News Network's Lou Waters now gives us a tour. The experts said Cable News Network couldn't be done. News Network has proven itself to viewers, cable systems, and the experts, our competition in the national news media. Hello, I'm Lou Waters, anchorman for Cable News Network. Ted Turner decided he wanted to give you a choice for 24-hour television news, Cable News Network for in-depth coverage, and when you don't have a lot of time, a new faster-paced CNN 2, a second news network from Turner Broadcasting System. And once again, the experts said... It couldn't be done. Well, this is it. We've built an enormous news complex, hired over 175 journalists, and bought the latest news technology to launch CNN 2, the ultimate news service for you, the busy person. By joining us for the premiere of CNN 2, just a few moments from now, you'll be part of television history. This preview look at CNN 2 and the first half-hour news program, starting at midnight, is being shared by over 20 million cable households on both the Superstation and the Cable News Network. This is the control room, the nerve center of CNN 2. It's not on the air yet, but starting at midnight, this control board will be live with news every minute of every day. And here's the man that can tell you more about what you'll see, Ted Kavanaugh, vice president of CNN 2. What you're going to see is the fastest presentation in the history of network news. We've brought together some top professionals, anchormen, producers, writers, directors from all over America, and we think we put together an organization that can put on this kind of presentation. You're busy, and we're busy doing the kind of show that we think fits in with your busy day. I think the people who work here recognize the fact that they're doing a very difficult task. They've been asked to uh, accomplish something never accomplished before. It's difficult. It's, it's wearing. It's tiring. But hopefully, all the effort will be worth it. In a few minutes, we'll see the fruits of their labor, and they'll have their own footnote in history. Here's where the writers and the editors will be working to keep you instantly updated. CNN 2 will be brought to you live and continuously updated with highly visual coverage. To tell you more, here's senior producer Paul Amos. The person that watches CNN 2 is going to be able to tune in and just in a few minutes' time, not only find out everything that's going on in the world, but will also be transported by television and the magic of satellites and modern technology to the places where the news is happening. If someone tunes into CNN 2, in half an hour they'll get the entire world delivered to their living room. The way we're about to put on a newscast has never been done before. And it's a, it's a, uh, it's a courageous and uh, very uh, avant-garde step in television news. And we think that, I think, that uh, as soon as a person watches one CNN 2 newscast, the other newscast that they're used to watching will never be the same again. 
This is our satellite master control that lets CNN2 span the globe instantly. The news happens fast, and CNN2 moves even faster with a truly international news organization. CNN2 is your 24-hour update channel for news from Poland. The cable news network covers Europe with bureaus and reporters in London and Rome, reporting throughout the continent. And CNN2 has bureaus in both Cairo and Jerusalem to bring you 24-hour updates on the Mideast situation. And CNN2's Tokyo Bureau covers the news from the Far East, China, and Japan. CNN2 will take you around the world and back again every 30 minutes of every day. Every story is backed by the professionalism and resources that Turner Broadcasting is noted for. CNN2 is the ultimate news service for the busy person, and here's where it all comes together, where in a few minutes, Denise Claire and Chuck Roberts will launch CNN2 to a preview audience of 20 million cable homes. Here are a few of the anchor people who will be bringing you 24 hours of news on CNN2. Dan Hackle, a veteran foreign correspondent, comes to CNN2 from the Cable News Network. Chuck Roberts brings years of anchor experience to CNN2 from across the nation. Denise LeClaire from Cable News Network has also anchored the news in Nashville and Providence. Peter Ford from Australia's 7 Network brings international news credentials to CNN2. Sasha Fu from Cable News Network has news experience in Boston, Philadelphia, and Tulsa. Patricia Harvey joins us from WNEM-TV in Michigan. Jay Young has anchored the news News in Baton Rouge. Bobby Batista joined CNN2 after years of news anchor experience in Raleigh. Rick Brown joined CNN2 from Canada with anchor, reporting, and producing credentials. And Jim Wilkerson from the Cable News Network brings years of anchor experience from Denver and Atlanta. If your world moves fast, in a few moments you'll see a news service that moves even faster. CNN2 moves at the speed of fast-breaking stories everywhere. CNN2 with the top news stories, special business features, weather, sports, unique feature reports. At midnight, you'll have a choice for 24-hour television news, cable news network for all the news in depth, and the new CNN2, the ultimate news service for busy people. It's a lot of news when you don't have a lot of time. Yes, Ted Turner proved the experts were wrong when he dedicated the news channel 19 months ago. To act upon one's convictions while others wait. To create a positive force in a world where cynics abound. To provide information to people when it wasn't available before. To offer those who want it a choice. For the American people whose thirst for understanding and a better life has made this venture possible. For the cable industry whose pioneering spirit caused this great step forward in communications, I dedicate the news channel for America, the Cable News Network. This New Year's Eve is truly a time for celebration for the Turner Broadcasting System. 1981 has been a year of unprecedented growth for Superstation WTBS and a year of history making growth for the Cable News Network. Now tonight we celebrate with you the premiere of the nation's second 24-hour television news network, CNN2. I'm glad all of you in the 20 million cable preview homes could join us for this exciting moment in the history of communications. In a world of conflict and change, America deserves and demands a second news network. And in a few moments, we'll share together the birth of cable television's new era. I'd also like to personally remind you that if you don't have CNN2 on your cable system and are watching this special preview on the Superstation or the Cable News Network, I urge you to contact your cable operator and tell him you want to have a choice for 24-hour television news, the Cable News Network, and CNN, too. Tonight, as your family celebrate the new year, I'd like to thank you again for sharing with us our celebration of the premiere of CNN, too. Happy New Year from all of us at the Turner Broadcasting System. And in just a few moments, you'll be able to see the fruits of our labor as CNN, too, debuts. But first, the countdown continues as 1981 draws to a close. We want to wish you Happy New Year. We're going back live to New York City, where the crowd in Times Square, as you can see, is getting rather anxious as this new year approaches. And our man there, correspondent James Allen Miklaszewski, has